All right. Thank you so much for tuning back into another reaction video. My name is Chris. My name is Sam. And we are Offset Era. Woohoo! Oh, yeah. All right. As you've seen in the title, we're bringing in a new group. That's right. We're called... bringing in Within Temptation. Temptation. The song we were requested to check out was And We Run. Featuring Exhibit. Exhibit. So I just thought this was so strange because from what we've seen, this is a power metal band symphonic metal uh Excuse and they're also calling them alternative metal yeah they're listed doom at metal. yeah symphonic yeah doom metal or at least um for their earlier stuff their, their early days doom metal yeah but yeah so we're not well, sure how this is gonna met it said we consider ourselves more an atmospheric melodic symphonic metal rock band in my opinion we are not a gothic band but we have gothic elements okay interesting so yeah so uh as we normally do when we bring in a new band on our channel we're, we're checking out their wikipedia we're and that's what i there. that's what i was just reading off of their yeah. uh, wikipedia opening so what do we know about within temptation within temptation is a dutch symphonic metal band formed in 1996 by vocalist sharon den adele and guitarist robert westerholt they've been classified by critics as gothic metal and symphonic metal, although each album contains influences outside of these genres. So we went over how long they've been together. Long time, 1996. So yep, been around almost, for a long time. Uh, yep, 27 years. A couple of members here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven members. Lots of past members. All right. We're checking out, uh, like I said, And We Run featuring an exhibit. This video has 23 million views from nine years ago, so it's older. But, we haven't heard of yeah. this band. I've never heard of this band. Uh, and the fact that Exhibit is on here is just so, so strange to me. So how does, and I, I just, I can't fathom power metal or gothic metal or ambient metal. With the uh, hip hop, with, with the rapper. A, yeah, with Exhibit? I mean, I mean, I mean, rap and metal have, have, you know, come together before. I mean, right. Anthrax did it with Public Enemy in the 90s. Right. With that song, Bring the Noise. Right. And obviously there's a whole subgenre of it which came to be in the 90s. <laughs> right. But with symphonic metal, I just really haven't heard this side of it yet. So this will be very interesting. Yeah. Uh, before we jump into the video, let's check a couple comments out, see what we got here. I am surprised that I discovered this seven years after it got released. This is amazing. Reminds me of my teenage years. Huh. So it's got a nostalgic feel for you. That's okay, cool. cool. This song is my anthem for this year. I've overcome so much in my life. This is my moment to shine and live life to the fullest. Thank you, Exhibit, and Within Temptation for this masterpiece. Nice. Hmm. Okay. This song is a masterpiece. The blending of genres is what makes it so iconic. Okay, I'm interested to see. That's kind of what we're here for. This song has gotten me through some of the worst moments of my life. I will love it forever. Wow, seems like it's very empowering to most people. Uh, it's unbelievable how they managed to combine rap and symphonic metal and produce such a great song out of it. Man, lots of praise here about how they're A lot of praise for this unconventional it. collaboration. Yeah. I've been a huge fan of Within Temptation since 2000. Parentheses, Mother, Mother Earth. Earth. And I really like Exhibit as a singer, rapper, and actor, too. And Combined is a feast for the ears, plus the very strong message. Thank you so much for this great song, which became my absolute favorite song. Awesome. All right. Well, I think we're ready to jump in. I think so. And for anyone jumping in with us for the very first time, welcome to the channel. Welcome, indeed. This won't be our first dive into symphonic metal. We have a quite a bit of different symphonic metal channels. Uh, we've done Winter Sun. We've done Nightwish. We've done Epica. We've done tons. Also, if you like that, check our playlist out. I'm sure you'll find something there. And just, you know, comb through our channel. We have tons and tons. Yeah. But uh, yeah, if you're not new to the channel, you, you know, know what, what time, time it is. is. It's time for the glorious, the epic transition. Trans <laughs> All right, and here we are. All right, without further ado, within temptation, and we run featuring exhibit official music video. It's official. Here we go. Here I have we no go. idea how this is gonna go. This is so such a strange mix to me. We're about to find out. Yes. Let freedom reign. The, the sun, sun shall, shall never, never set, set on so glorious a human achievement. So hmm. says Nelson Mandela. Okay. Is that exhibit? Thanks. It's all the tubes. Is she in heaven? <clears throat> it burns into your heart. The darkness that you fear. You are never free. A lot of special effects in this. Holy crap. Wow. 
this is a wild video. Okay. Okay. So I would say the approach is not, I wouldn't say that was rapping. I think that was chanting, you know, I wouldn't. So they're not going to stop what they're doing. It sounds like I would, I would see, I was hoping it would go into something funkier or something that he could actually rap over. And typically when I, when I, I listen to some hip hop, but we haven't done a ton of hip hop on this channel. Uh, but there are some things that I do like, and I do. I mean, I, not all rap has to be fast, uh, but you know, I'd rather it be at least on top of the beat in something that's moving. And so the song itself, it's a symphon, it's a symphonic metal song. So they're not going to be playing fast or double time or anything. Yeah, like that. it's very like. It's very drawn out. It's very bigger than normal. It's very like an opus. And so far, we've heard like a very big, gradual buildup. So uh, they didn't want to, and I understand you not want to, you build up all that momentum. So you do not want the other, you know, this other vocalist to come in here and kind of like stop that train from going. So I hear what they're trying to do, and it's more of a spoken vocal, I would call it, but I wouldn't call it rapping. And now he's in it, he, it does, but would I call that hip-hop? I don't know if I would at this point. We're going to listen to it a little bit further, but to me, it's it's just a symphonic metal song that he happens to be on. I wouldn't call this hip-hop uh, so far. Um, and it, so we can, you can argue with all that you want in the you know in the comments, but to me, this seems to me like he's just fitting what he can do vocally into a symphonic metal song. It's cool. It doesn't sound terrible. He's adding like a good intensity to it. Um, but again, I don't really feel like uh, it's uh, it's rap. I don't feel like this is hip hop. Don't wait, you miss it. Lift up your head. This video, what the heck is going on? I don't know. <laughs> so, if I were to analyze a video, we have two different story of devi deviations. Yeah, two different, two different lightings. The band is like in heaven or some celestial, some plane. sort of other planet or something. Yeah, it's floating in the clouds, colorful. It opens up on exhibit tied to tubes. Which I don't know if that's like a drug reference, maybe a drug addiction reference. And he's like some, breaking. Some, maybe maybe if we were to lean into it, we'd say he was trapped by his addiction. He's breaking free. He's in a dark place. It's gray. It's dark. There's no color. He's escaping. It's raining outside. It's very dramatic. It's kind of what I'm getting so far. That's not a bad way to go about it. Yeah. There we go. All right, so this is what I was hoping to hear. So a little bit more rapping. Yeah. Now I would call that closer to rapping, even though we're not really getting a hip hop beat. We're getting more of just kind of like a break. Uh, what I'd call like a four on the floor with a ride. So it's just boom, 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 boom. But he's just choosing to rap over that. Yeah. I'm interested to hear what he has to say here. Never lose hope, this is my time now. No time for tears, celebrate, put it in the air right now. Never back down. 
down. You can never wear my crown because it weighs too much. And I crush every motherfucking thing I touch. This is love. I never love so much. Get involved. Make the world stand up. Give my life before I ever give up. Naming lights. You lost all my trust. Now it's time to face all the us. Get in line because we're calling us. And it feels so marvelous. Just take my head and run. Okay. here of course that's how it ends <laughs> wow the video is over the top yeah oh my god all right let's flip over here all right that was with in temptation we and we run featuring exhibit and we run what you can say i mean it was i like the song i think uh um the vocals and everything sounded good uh, it was very light on the instrumentation, really. It I was. I feel like most of it was carried by the symphony parts, really. I yeah. Mean, it was more symphonic than anything. The guitars did chug a little bit throughout. There was no solos. There's no breakdown. I didn't hear a bass guitar, I don't think. Anything predominant. Uh, well, I think more of the song was more about the exhibit and the vocalist and yeah. the melody. Uh, there was a huge focus on the vel- you know, the melody. Obviously, the 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 video had a very cinematic feel, uh, really trying to tell a story. Uh, I think I think when I mentioned the the addiction thing, that's the only thing I can think of. But it could be escaping from really anything: depression, you know, being down, feeling in a dark place, feeling lonely, whatever, breaking your walls down. You could see a lot of different symbology yeah. or symb- symbolism um, there. Uh, so, you know, as far as the video goes, I can definitely see why some people would say that this made them feel good, which is yeah. good. I mean, I'm glad the, the, uh, it, the message, you know, about, you know, escaping your own personal hell or whatever it is that you're dealing with, it, you know, sinking in with a lot of people and resonating with people. That's always good. I mean, ever, anytime anyone feels something for music, you know, I respect that for sure. Uh, but yeah, that was it. I think it was good. I, I mean, it was a little... It was on the tame side, I would say. You know, for me. I would just feel like it was good. It wasn't great. The uh, the exhibit, the very first exhibit, like bar or whatever we heard from him, was just kind of lackluster in my opinion. His rap at the end was okay as well. I don't think it was like anything groundbreaking. I think it fit the song just fine. Yeah. Um, I don't think that. Uh, I don't know if I could, if you could really mesh these two these two genres any differently and come out with a better result. So I'm not suggesting that I could do any better. Um, I think it, it was cool for what it was. I think that's yeah. the best way to say it. Um, but we love checking out new stuff. So yeah. So if send anyone, it through, you know, anyone, anyone in the comments, leave uh, recommendations for any other music videos from within temptation studio, uh, official music videos, any um, high quality live videos, session videos. Mm-hmm. We are, genuinely intrigued and yeah we are not opposed to checking out within temptation uh, in the future or any other bands that are kind of like this or any other mashups this exactly is, anything these, like uh, these these team ups these, these mashups are very uh very interesting that's yeah. that's it's very unconventional a hip-hop artist with symphonic, symphonic metal. metal yeah it's very you strange know, I, I mean like a group like a like a straight groove metal band or a thrash band like like that's how Public Enemy and Anthrax made it work. Yeah. You know, you know, hard, you know, hard attitude in, in each of the yeah of the camps. You know, slamming music. Yeah. All right, but that was our reaction to Within Temptation and uh, and we won from Exhibit, the official music video. Yep. We are Offset Era. We are two thirds of Offset Era. Which is a band. It is. That we are it. <laughs> 
that we play music. We do all original music. We've done just, uh, we've recorded several music of several different albums in the past. We just put out our most recent effort, which is A New Era. Six all original new songs. Yep. Going into a heavier direction for ourselves. Yep. Uh, like a hardcore kind of more of a vibe with pop punk mixed in. It's a little tricky to describe. If you yeah. want to get what we mean, listen to the music. Yeah. Let the music do the talking. Exactly. The video will be popping up at the end of this video called Watch It Burn. It's our own music video shot yep. at the our first video. single off the new album. Yes. And it was shot out, uh, shot at our favorite, one of our favorite venues. All these pub records and beer. There we go. It was shot there. We had a great time. Make sure you check out the video if you haven't seen that before. If you want to check out our original music, we have a playlist on our playlist, on our channel under playlists, and we also have it available on all the streaming platforms. Yep. We also have a show coming up. We we are going to be at Nice Guys uh, in Cape Coral, Saturday, September 23rd, with Discord Theory, Take Lead, Gutter Love, and Perfect Sequence. Yes. Looking forward to that show. If you happen to be in the Cape Coral, Fort Myers area, we'd love to see you down there. Uh, but that's it for the video. Thank you so much for commenting, subscribing, and everything you guys do to support us. We really appreciate it. We Thanks. sincerely do. Thank you so much for being here. Let us know what you want to see next, and we'll see you in the next one. Take care. See ya.